singing is, is very primitive to us as human beings, yet it's something that more and more we block out and we get so caught up with, with social media and technology that we're literally talking to boxes and screens most of the time instead of connecting with our spirits and our souls and our voices and connecting with other people. One of the best things about singing is that it takes you right into the present moment. It's a form of active meditation where your mind, your body and your spirit are all at one. You transcend your daily cares, your worries about the future, your regrets about the past and you're just in the present moment. What could be more special than that? Singing helps us get back to our tribal self, our unique self, our unique voice and to connect with other people in a whole different way. It's very important for our health and well-being and, and our futures as a human race. I always wanted to be a singer and when we were 14 we could start learning singing at my school and I asked mum if I could have lessons and I was doing a lot of other things sport and she said just wait for a while but my best girlfriend started having lessons. So one night I was at her place and I asked her if she'd teach me the song that she'd been learning at singing lesson and we sang it a few times and she could play the piano and then she said look I'll play and you sing on your own. So she played and I sang and then she said to me Tanya I don't think you should ever bother having singing lessons you're not good enough and like many of us out there I, I believed her and so the next year I did backstage in the school musical and Finally in year 11 I got the courage up to audition for the chorus of the musical Oklahoma and to my amazement I got the lead role and that's when I started to actually uh, take singing lessons and, and started to see that maybe actually I could, I could have singing as, as my career um, and yeah it's been my lifelong passion um, ever since. I always lacked a bit of confidence in my singing voice, um, even when I was singing professionally I always thought, you know, am I good enough, um, you know, that little voice go, I'm not good enough <laughs> and that's something that we all have and we just, we just have to get, get through that. But also the good thing about that little voice is it always makes you get better. I don't like to ever think that I'm, I'm good enough and that I've made it. <laughs> I think that your voice, it's part of your human journey and your voice really does express who you are so it's something you need to keep working on throughout your life.